welcome to today's video. So today's going to be our Thanksgiving vlog. Um, I'm starting the day before Thanksgiving because we have only one thing to like pre-make. Um, we wanted to make our, we wanted to make some fruit salad. Um, I don't know if everybody does this. When I was growing up, my mom made it every single Thanksgiving. Um, what it consists of is some canned fruit. Um, we get the one in like super light syrup, some sour cream to kind of even it, even out the whipped cream. Um, now the whipped cream you can use like fat free, regular, or like sugar free. So per my mom's recipe, she used um, like pumpkin pieces. She used um, pecan pieces, and then she also used um, like the shaved uh, coconut flakes. But um, I don't think my kids are going to enjoy that. You know, Teo doesn't like coconut flakes because he doesn't like it in his popsicles. So I'm not going to put that in ours. Um, and I think the pecans I might even put on like as garnish on whoever's bowl. Like whoever wants it, they can garnish it themselves. But super simple recipe. My kids are going to help me make it. Oh, marshmallows. I almost forgot marshmallows. marshmallows. Yeah, marshmallows are also in there. Um, you can use, you know, obviously whichever ones you want. There's like the colored ones or the regular ones, the jumbo ones or the mini ones. <laughs> um, but we're going to use, I believe I have many white ones, but yeah, we're going to throw this together really quick. We're going to put it in the fridge so it can chill overnight and it'll be nice and, um, settled in for tomorrow. If you're new here, I wanted to say hi. My name is Isabel Floriano. I'm a Christian mom with three kiddos. Uh, their ages are two, four, and nine. Here on my channel, I do lots of vlogs. Um, I do birthday vlogs, day-to-day -day vlogs. Um, oh, and we homeschool, so you'll see some of that content as well. Yeah, let's go ahead and get into today's video. So we're just gonna do it. Okay, we've got the fruit in here. See the fruit. Okay, one cash. Okay, we're gonna put that right there. Everything's yummy. Okay. So, sugar cherry.
It took the kids and I probably about five minutes to whip it up, but it gave us a pretty good sized yeah. bowl. I don't know how many like quarts this is, but um, I got that big bowl and we got some like personal saved for us. I just did the recipe based off of memory and I bought more because I wanted to make sure I had enough. But I bought four, uh, four 16 ounce cans of the mixed fruit. Um, and this was a tub, a 16 ounce tub of whipped topping. And then I used um, half a, let me see if I can grab I use about half of this. So I use about four ounces of this, which is basically just half of it. And then, and then we use about half a bag of marshmallows or squishmallows as Teo calls them. <laughs> Um, and then I had some of this Watkins, Watkins food coloring, but we use, I believe I got this off of Amazon or Target because Walmart didn't carry it. Um, but yeah, well worth it. I think sometimes the, the color kind of changes because it's natural food dyes or natural coloring. So now we're going to go ahead and do a Thanksgiving craft. Um, I'll see what we end up putting. I asked the kids if they wanted to do a Thanksgiving craft or a Grinch craft because we've been into the Grinch a lot lately. Decided to do the Grinch craft. Um, I'm gonna post the picture here of what we plan to do and how they actually turn out. They seem pretty simple, but I don't know. Even the simple crafts can be kind of difficult. Um, I had to dig into my Valentine's Day crafts and get some red hearts, but um, we had these extra pipe cleaners from last year, thank goodness, and uh, we also have these extra ones from like the other little ornament craft kit that we had. So we're just using all the leftovers and kind of just making up our own thing. trees came out they're pretty difficult if you ask me um, my husband is the one that did Isaac's this is Isaac's he kind of figured it out at first um, Teo just decided to do a wreath so cute um, this one is Mia's she wants to do a little pink heart oh it's cute it's best to do like a Grinch tree where it leans over on a scale of like 1 to 10 difficulty I would say it's probably about a 9 <laughs> um, craft wise like uh, Mia could do it. She's nine. Isaac needed help. Teo didn't even care about it. Um, it took me a little bit to get the hang of it, but I don't know. Pipe cleaners in just like a free form is kind of tough to do, but it was fine. Happy Thanksgiving, everyone. Today is Thanksgiving. I already went to my in-laws and we had Thanksgiving lunch there. We came back and we just had to basically heat up the ham. So my husband's doing the ham. My parents and my brother are coming over. Um, and then we also invited my in-laws, so we'll see if they come if they want to. Henry Hipple. Yeah, Henry Hipple. Henry Hipple. Henry Hipple. We should all be thankful for the blessings of this place. There are fairs and shows, dances and games. Guys, that'll be it for today's video. Thank you so much for hanging out with me and clicking on this video. I really enjoy having you here. If you are new to my channel, please subscribe and don't forget to hit that notification bell. But I will see you in the next video. Bye.